These are five products that you could start testing, selling, and scaling starting today. What's up beautiful people? It's Nas here and in this video I'm going to talk about the five products hand-picked by myself. I got the videos made for you guys. Uh, technically I paid someone else to do it but I also have the ad copy, the AliExpress link and the product page. If you guys want to know what these products are, keep watching. Before we get started though, make sure that you like this video. It helps the channel grow so I can make you guys weekly videos and it's free. Just make sure you like this video. I'll put all these products in a Google Doc and if you guys are interested in getting the link, the product page and the videos, make sure you stay till the end of this video. I'm going to tell you exactly how you can get these videos. All right, let's get into it. Product number one is this gold playing card. It's pretty unique. As you guys know, I have a couple of rules when I'm looking for products. Number one is the product needs to be passionate or it needs to solve a problem. This product could be very passionate, uh, so it definitely fits the first category. Number two, it needs to be unique. This is a gold playing card, so it automatically makes it unique. It's different from other cards. It's not easily found in stores, uh, and then this, is, this is something that I always look for. Number three, they need to have under 500 orders on AliExpress. I personally like to go and find unsaturated products they can be scaled way bigger and higher than trying to test saturated products. Uh, this one is around 508, it's fine. If you go a couple over it, that's totally fine. Number four, it needs to make sense to sell it for $20 more. The reason I say $20 margin is because I already calculated uh, average cost, uh, cost per purchase on Facebook, processing fees and everything and how much you want it to be left as profit for yourself. Now let's take a quick look at this video that we got made. <laughs> is sold for about three dollars and some I think a dollar something for shipping so it's around five dollars I would try to personally sell it for $25.95 this is an example product page it's not my own product page I just did a quick Google search just to show you guys an example product page for this product uh, scrolling down definitely I would increase my price right here a lot of people you might see um, that are selling for a little bit less. They're actually dropshippers in China. They can usually get away with selling their product cheaper than I usually recommend. So scrolling down, I personally do not like these kind of old guaranteed safe checkout. Um, but scrolling down again, they have like these little animation, which I, which I really, really like. And I think it really makes your page engaging. I like using different colors. So I like that here they're using different colors and matches the card. Uh, also, the landing page is pretty good. Um, the landing page photo, which again, I like to have someone using the product. They have a hand in here. Probably it would be better if they were playing games, but that's fine for now. I do not like to have this share buttons here. It's totally fine though. Uh, we're going to scroll down and they have more animation features, photos showing that the product is waterproof and specifications, package included and all that. So. All in all, it's a decent product page. I would probably make a couple changes, uh, but you can kind of get inspired if you're trying to test this product. You can kind of get inspiration from these pages that I'm showing you. Product number two. Next product is this 90 degree laser level. It would help a lot of craftsmen with measuring and keeping things accurate. Obviously, this is a very problem solving product. It's uh, pretty cheap from China is about I believe yeah 1033 let's take a quick look at the video that I got made for this product
take a look at the example product page that I found. Again, this is not my own personal product page. These are the ones that I found just doing a quick Google search. So here we are. Um, I don't like the theme that they're using, but uh, I guess if this one, the specific one, was uh, the main product page photo, that would be definitely way better than having these all combined together. Uh, scrolling down, let's look at, take a look at the explanation. Again, one thing that I really like is using animation, Giphy, Jiffies, or whatever they call, and then having the features, having different colors, um, explaining the product more, probably adding some photos on here. There we are, we have some over here. I want you guys to use this product page recommendations just as an example, not necessarily to go copy them. And also, these are not perfect. Nobody product, nobody's product page can be 100% perfect, but it's pretty important to have a good product page. Our targeted market for the products that we're selling are impulse buyers. And keep in mind, you would need a great product page uh, for people to go and buy the product. A lot of people don't go look at your other product pages or your other part of your website. They would most likely go on the product page and decide if they want to buy that product or not. Next product is this flying fish. If you guys remember a couple years ago, it used to be a big winning product, but recently I haven't seen anybody scaling this. I did a quick search on AliExpress and went through a bunch of suppliers. They all pretty much have under 200 orders, which could be a good sign, meaning that not a lot of people are scaling that product. Also, if you didn't know this number that you always see in front of uh, the AliExpress page is the amount of orders in the last 30 days. So it shows you if people are actually scaling that product through AliExpress or not. Here's the video that I got made for it. a lot of emotions into it people are playing with it with this there are kids around uh, it it makes people relate to that video that's one thing that I really really like to see in product videos is people engaging with the product people using their product people having fun or if it's a problem solver uh, it could be something that is it shows that it's solving a big problem I don't like shots of just the product you want uh, basically the videos of product being used Here's an example of product page for this. Again, I really like their landing photo. It shows someone that is at work and probably a coworker or something. It's probably trying to prank this guy and he's kind of scared. I like their buy it now. It's, it kind of pops. Um, I like when people do that. I don't, I don't like to share this now. We don't want people to go uh, to get out of your website. Scrolling down, I like that they have different colors. They have um, very visual product page um, they have nice fonts are there that they're using i would probably align this a little bit better it looks a little messy when i'm scrolling down but you know it's not the most important thing at this point um, i personally like to have everything kind of clean and uh, organized as specifications here scrolling down more photos and showing the packaging and what it comes with it and then again if you want to contact them which is really really important you want to have that at the end of your product page i definitely recommend and they also have a couple good looking product uh, product um, photos this product is selling for 12.86 and the selling price that i recommend you guys can sell it for is 34.95 or this page actually they're selling it for 39.99 so, you know, you can always play, play around with the pr different pricing and see which one performs better. And if it sells for higher, you can always sell it for that, that amount. Next product is this neck pillow or neck hammock. You might have seen it again a couple years ago. A lot of products could come back. So if you see some of these products and you'll feel like they're older products, just keep in mind a lot of old winning products, just people forget about them and you could kind of bring them back and sell it again and scale them again. Actually, a lot of my winning products recently been uh, past winning products from like three, four years ago uh, that I found in like some product research methods that I've been using. Uh, so don't worry about it if you feel like, oh, if you've been in, in the game for a while and you feel like, oh, this is, I know this product, but it could be old enough for you to bring it back again, if that makes sense. 
So here we are. This is this hammock for neck pain. So it's definitely a problem solving. It's for $13.04 in uh, with some shipping ta shipping costs. It's about $15.04. And the selling price that I recommend you guys can sell for is $35.95. Let's take a look at the video that I got made for this. It's very emotional and it shows exactly people using it and how they're enjoying this uh, product. It definitely makes me wanna want one. I'm gonna sometimes have neck pain, you know? I feel like I'm just pulling it and my neck is like all the shit. Let's take a look at the example page that I found on the internet. Here we are. I do not like that they don't have someone using the product. I would probably put that one as my main one. And uh, probably put these if I really want to use these at the other photos. And here, and the text is a little too small, but they're using a nice font. I probably get it a little bit bigger. And I like that they, this is bold. Scrolling down, they're using some jiffy giffies, whatever. And again, more photos, more explanation. Probably, I, I kind of like this product page. I would make the text a little bit bigger. Last product is this crystal soil. If you remember about two years ago, a lot of people were scaling this product. Uh, I did a quick search on AliExpress. There's not that many people really scaling this. Uh, actually, they mostly had under 100 orders, which is kind of crazy because it used to be a very big product. What it does basically, it kind of, it's a soil, it's a gel soil that you could uh, plant seeds in it and then it basically grows. It's a very passionate audience, people that like planting, people that like to do these kind of stuff, uh, you could definitely target uh, plant lovers. Here's the video that I got made for this. video it's very engaging with the product and I like how there's different scene of people using the product differently that's the type of video that we really really want and the most important part of your video keep in mind is the first five seconds people are just scrolling on Instagram and Facebook so you got to make sure that you grab their attention and yeah here's the product page example the first product it shows a different uh, way of using it I like this I would probably not put this in here I use one of these just to show people how they can use it. Uh, and I like that they're using different colors. I definitely like this little animation showing exactly how you can literally grow uh, actual plants from it, which is pretty cool. I love this photo using different colors, using different animations. These are the type of things that I like to see in a product page. And also specification and, the, and at the end you want to definitely include uh, your you know 30 day guaranteed your uh, contact information at the end of the product page this product was for 2052 I recommend you guys selling it for 2495 you can always split test pricing uh, but always keep in mind that Facebook ads are getting a little bit more expensive so you want to at least give that product a $20 margin as I promised I'm gonna be giving away this list so you can go ahead and use these videos if you want to start testing scaling selling these products and let me know what the results are. All you gotta do to get this list is make sure that you like this video and then comment down below what video do you want me to make. Then you gotta go on my Instagram, make sure you follow me there and then DM me the word Shopify list and I'll send you the list to your DM. Also, if any of you guys need help with your dropshipping store, you want me to help you, personally start and scale your dropshipping business go ahead on instagram dm me the word dropshipping i'll ask you a couple questions and see where you are with your business and where if we are the right match to work together and we'll go from there thank you guys for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you guys on the next video